hey y'all welcome back to my channel today i'm gonna show you how to make this delicious comfort soup so make sure that you stick around and keep watching For this recipe, you'll need green lentils, diced tomatoes, chicken broth, or if you're vegan, you can use vegetable broth. You'll also need kale, so make sure that you clean it first and you wanna remove the stems. If you do not like kale, you can also use spinach. You'll need fresh minced garlic. You'll also need carrots, celery, and onions. Chop those vegetables down to a small size. I did all of my chopping off camera because this was easiest for me was to just prep everything and then film. But this is the size of the vegetables that you want. I'm gonna be using salt and pepper, bay leaves, chili powder, cayenne red pepper, coriander, paprika, and cumin. So let's get started. First, you need to pick through your lentils, get rid of any bad ones, and rinse the remaining under running water. And you can let these sit to the side while you work on the other ingredients. So let's go to the stove. Add some oil to a pot on medium heat. We're gonna saute the onions and garlic until they are translucent in color. And this should take about five minutes. Next, you're gonna add the celery and let this cook for about two and a half minutes or until all the vegetables are tender. Now you're gonna add the spices, but do not add any salt or pepper. We're gonna add that last. Let this continue to cook until the spices are nice and fragrant, which should take about two to three minutes. Now add the diced tomatoes, give it a quick stir. Then next, you wanna add the chicken broth, lentils, carrots, and the bay leaf. We're gonna bring this to a boil and then reduce the heat to low for about 30 to 45 minutes or until the lentils are tender. So once the lentils are almost done, you need to season the pot with salt and pepper. Don't forget to remove the bay leaves. Go ahead and throw in the torn kale leaves or if you're using spinach, throw it in there and you wanna let it cook until it is wilted. So the total cooking time for this pot of soup was about mm, just under an hour. This lentil soup was so, so good. This was one of my favorite soups, you guys. You've got to try it. There's so much you can do with it. You can adjust those, spi those spices according to what you like. You can add some meat. This soup was so good, it was so spot on. I hope that you guys will give this recipe a try. Give me a thumbs up if you like this video and I hope to catch you in my next one. Ooh.